Hello viewers, welcome to my channel PMCE. In this video, we are going to see number activities on 5 and 6 digit numbers under the number concepts. As we are in class 4 now, we will be dealing with large numbers, 5 and 6 digit numbers. Viewers, if you are here for the first time, please do visit my video, why should I subscribe to this channel PMCE and also my introduction to PMCE channel video to understand what you can expect from my channel and what are the contents I will be dealing with in my videos. Let us go on to the details of this video now. Links for these two videos which I told you will be given below in the description box and also in the iCard section. To begin with, these are all the learning outcomes which you will be seeing in class 4 under the concept numbers. Place value concepts Number activities on 5 and 6 digit numbers, comparing numbers, rounding numbers and writing Roman numerals 1 to 39. I have dealt with each of these learning outcomes in separate videos and link for the same is also given below in the description box. In this video we are going to see about the number activities which we will be performing on 5 and 6 digit numbers. They are we will be writing down the greatest and smallest 5 and 6 digit numbers. We will be writing 1000, 10,000 and lakh less than and more than numbers. Before we write the greatest and smallest 5 and 6 digit numbers, let us see the evolution ladder of numbers from class 1. This is what I try to do in my channel. I give you a link to show how we have evolved concept wise and in complexity wise from class 1 to class 5. Since we are dealing with concept numbers here, I have shown you the evolution ladder of concept numbers. Let us see that now. In class 1, we would have studied about the 2 digit numbers from 1 to 100. 100 is a 3 digit number. We would have dealt from 1 to 99. We would have learnt about ordinal numbers. Then in class 2, we would have dealt completely with 3 digit numbers and also learnt odd and even numbers. In class 3, we would have dealt all about 4 digit numbers. Now that we are in class 4, we are going to deal completely with 5 and 6 digit numbers and also learn Roman numerals from 1 to 39. 5 and 6 digit numbers are called as large numbers. And next when you go into class 5, you will be dealing with 7 and 8 digit numbers and also learn Roman numerals from 1 to 100. 7 and 8 are also called as large numbers. Now that we have seen what are all the type of uh, numbers we will be dealing with from class 1 to class 4, let us write down the greatest and smallest numbers in each of the type of digits. To begin with, for a 2 digit number, the smallest 2 digit number is 10 and the greatest 2 digit number is 99. We learnt about this in class 1. In class 2 we dealt with 3 digit numbers. What is the smallest 3 digit number? 100. 100 zero zero is the smallest 3 digit number and the greatest 3 digit number is 999. In class 3, we dealt with 4 digit numbers. The smallest 4 digit number is 1000 and the greatest 4 digit number is 9999. Now in class 4, we are going to deal with 5 and 6 digit numbers. What is the smallest 5 digit number? It is 10,000. Notice the usage of periods. I have explained about all this in my place value videos for 5 digit numbers and 6 digit numbers. So this is called as a period and you read large numbers from 5 digits using the periods. So this is called as a number 10,000 and the greatest 5 digit number is 99,999. 
Next, we'll also be dealing with six digit numbers in class four. So, what is the smallest six digit number? It is ones, tens, hundreds, thousand, ten thousand, lakh. So, we have six digit over here, and this number is called as one lakh. I have dealt very clearly about the place values lakh and ten thousand in my place value videos for five and six digit numbers. The links for those videos are given below in the description box and also in the i card section. And finally, the greatest six digit number is nine lakh ninety nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine. It is very important to know the smallest and greatest numbers because it helps in comparison of numbers and it also increases the number sense for the children. Next, let us move on to the topic. Thousand less than and more than numbers, ten thousand less than and more than numbers, and lakh less than and more than numbers. If you remember, in class three, we dealt with one less than and more than, ten less than and more than, hundred less than and more than, and also thousand less than and more than numbers, because in class three we were dealing with only four digit numbers. Now in class four, as we are dealing with five and six digit numbers, we are going to see ten thousand less than and more than numbers, and also lakh less than and more than numbers. Before going into those two, we'll have a quick revision of one less than and more than numbers for five and six digit numbers. We would have seen these concepts for four digit numbers in class three. Now in class four, we are going to see the same concept for five and six digit numbers. I'll be giving you a number over here, and you'll have to write down the one less than and one more than the number given. So we have been given with a five-digit number over here. The number is fifty-four thousand six hundred seventy-three. What is the rule to find out one less than? Since it is mentioned one less than, we'll have to look at the ones place. The remaining are not going to change. So one less than the ones place is going to give you. Fifty-four thousand six hundred and seventy-two. So one more than fifty-four thousand six hundred seventy-three will give you fifty-four thousand six hundred seventy-four. It is three plus one because we are dealing with the ones place, and the keyword to look for is less and more. If it is going to be less, you reach out for the ones place and you subtract one. If it is more, and if it is one more. You reach for the ones place and add one. Let us go on to the next sum. We want to do ten less than and ten more than now. Here we have been given with a six-digit number. It is one lakh twenty-eight thousand seven hundred sixty-five. And dear viewers, actually all these are mental math sums which should be done by the children. mentally and they should be able to tell the answers i am showing you here the logic that should be taught to the children so that they can do these sums mentally and tell you the answers these kind of mental math sums help children to increase their thinking capability so now we'll have to find out 10 less than the keyword is less so we'll have to subtract and 10 mentions that you'll have to look out for the tens place So in the tens place we have the number six. So we we'll have to subtract one from the tens place. So one lakh twenty eight thousand seven sixty five is the number. Ten less than that number will be one lakh twenty eight thousand seven hundred fifty five. So six minus one is five, and you get the answer one lakh twenty eight thousand seven hundred fifty five. What is ten more than the given number? We'll have to add one to the tens place. Ones place there will be no change, so it will be one lakh twenty-eight thousand seven hundred seventy-five. Hope the concept is clear. Next, we are going to do hundred less than and hundred more than the given number, which means we have to look at the hundreds place and subtract one from the given digit and. Because it is less, we are going to subtract. If it is hundred more than, you will be adding one to the digit in the hundreds place. So let us do the sum now. 
It is a five-digit number, 90,413. What do you have in the hundreds place? Ones, tens, hundreds. In hundreds place, we have the digit 4. So, 100 less than 90,413 will give you 90,313 because 4 minus 1 is 3. Next, 100 more than 90,413 will be 90,513 because you are adding a 1 to the digit in the hundreds place. The same logic, let us do 1000 less than 37,124. What is the answer? It is 36,124. The next question is 9,83,510. 1000 less than the given number is 9,82,510. This is something new which we are seeing in class 4. Till class 3 we saw 1000 more than or less than a number. Now we are going to see 3000 more than. So what you will do is, you will reach for the thousands place and add 3 to it. So 87,219 is the given number. 3000 more than this number will be 90,219. The next number is 1,65,024. 3000 more than this will be 1 lakh 68,000. 5 plus 3 is 8. So, 1 lakh 68,024. Next, we are going to do 6,000 less than a given number. So, we have 42,152. In the thousands place, we have the number 2. We will have to subtract 6 from that. This might require a little bit of calculation. So, you will get the answer 36,152. Next question is a straight one. 6,8,231. In the thousands place you have the number 8. So you have to subtract 6 from that and you will get 6,2,231. Let us move on to the next topic. 10,000 less than a given number. So the same way you will have to reach out the, the place value 10,000 and subtract 1. So 10,000 less than 37,124 will be 27,124. 3 minus 1 is 2. Next, you are given the number 9,83,510. 10,000 less than this will be 9,73,510. The next question is 6, 10,000 more than. This is something new. So, let us see how do you do that. 87,219. 6, 10,000 is nothing but 60,000. These kind of sums require a little bit of calculation. So, you will have to add 60,000 to this and you will get the answer 1,47,219. In the 10,000's place, we have the digit 8. So, 8 plus 6 is 14. So, the remaining digits are not going to change. So, it will be 1,47,219. 6, 10,000 more than 1, 65,024 will be, it's the same type of calculation, 1, 10, 100, 1000, 10,000, 6 plus 6 is 12. You write the number 2 over here and 1 gets carried over, 1 plus 1 is 2. These cannot be done by mental mathematics for class 4, but they can do it eventually with practice. So, you have to do lakh less than the given number. 2,42,152. These are all straight sums. So, we have to reach for the lakhs place which is 2 and subtract 1. So, 1,42,152. Next question is 6,8,231. 1 lakh less than this is 5,8,231. The last sum we are going to do is 3 lakhs more than the given number. 4,18,239. So, 3 lakhs more than this will be straight answer. 7,18,239. The last question is 5,98,124. And 3 lakhs more than that is 8,98,124. With that, we have completed the number activities for 5 and 6 digit numbers. Dear viewers, as I told you earlier, links to all related videos are provided below in the description box. If you like the content of my video, please click the subscribe button. Tap the bell button and all option for notification of all updates. 
Give a thumbs up and share the video and do provide your valuable comments. Thank you for watching my video. See you in the next session.